surgery. Okay, everyone, good morning and welcome to TheraBand. Um, as I have mentioned previously, I was at 22 hours of classes this weekend uh, for the latest and greatest of what's going on with seniors. And basically, they said that one of the most important forms of exercise is resistance. Uh, you've got to strengthen those muscle groups and work against gravity to get them strong so that you can prevent falls and keep active for activities of daily living. TheraBand is one of those best methods. Um, unfortunately, nothing new. Uh, you know, you can only hold a band so many ways. You can only move it so many ways. Uh, the only way we could punch this up is if we got on mats, and this um, group uh, altogether is not, it's mats and therabands are not really optimal. So we will keep our theraband class in a chair. We will do some segments of it standing, some seated. Uh, so uh, put up with the boredom a little bit, okay? Uh, you're gonna get strengthened and toned and pay attention to those muscle groups you're working. All right, everybody, let's get started. Neuro 
neuroplasticity, brush your teeth and do this at the same time. And heel, toe, heel, step, heel, toe, heel, step. All right, circle, make a fist, open up, circle, clench, open up, circle, clench, open up, circle, reverse, clench, open up, clench, open up, clench, circle, clench, and circle, and just run it. Clench and stretch. Let's get the shoulders a little, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, reverse, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, we're ready for the bands. Have a seat. that have advanced rheumatoid arthritis just winning a 100 mile race. We have another one with three knee replacements, scoliosis off the chain and tennis elbow in her 60s. There are people like you and me, but the difference is they've decided that they can do it and they will do it. So, we need to develop that attitude. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and side to side. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and circle. Two, Three and four. Reverse. Five, six, seven, eight. Lift. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And lift out to the side. Lift. Bring it in. And two, three. Four, five, six, 
seven, eight, and circle, two, three, four, reverse, five, six, seven, eight, take it out and over, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, so, you know, right there is more than what most people do each day. So you're really helping yourself to maintain lower body uh, mobility and flexibility. Now you can stand for this section or remain seated. So you're going to wrap the band in front, take it behind. Now if you stand, you're probably going to want to come to the side of the chair for a little bit of balance if you need to and hold on or not. You can get more balance work if you don't, but uh, that's something to work toward. So if you feel that you need to hang on, fine. All right, we're going to abduct to the side. One, and back in. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And pulse. Two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other side. Pulse. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Kick forward and back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and pulse. Two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Take it back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, now we're going to make little circles with that foot. So we circle. Two, three, four. Reverse it in. Five, six, seven, and eight. Other side. Kick. Ten. Take it back. Two.
seven, and eight. And if you notice, as you're, if you're standing, this whole side is really getting a workout too, especially the glute medius. So that's another way to add another layer of strength in. And circle, two, three, four, reverse, five, six, seven, and eight. Okay, other side. So if you're standing, come to the other side of the chair. And bring it in and down. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and pulse it. In, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and down. All right, we lift, have duck. And down, lift, out, in, and down. Three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Seven, eight, 
eight and pulse two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, foot forward, other back, here we go. Palm up, keep the arm close to the body, lift, pull it in, getting those triceps. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, pulse, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Stretches. Band above the head. Two feet center of the band. Palm up. 
working one at a time. That strengthens the arm more than working both, actually. All right, so keep the elbow in to the waistline here, or to the ribs, and to the shoulder. Now stretch it all the way down. And two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and pulse. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and down. Other foot. Come up, elbow in, base it there. Don't let it fly out like this. You want it in. All right, now to the shoulder and down. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and pulse. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and down. All right, so now. We're going to do both. The elbows are coming in and those arms are going to come out to the side and up to the shoulder, not straight ahead. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight and pulse two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and down. All right, roll the shoulders back. All righty, so now uh, let's see, we've done biceps. All right, delts anterior delt, posterior delt around the shoulder. And I like to sit for these. Um, all right, elbows are up. We lift and now pull the elbows into the center. Two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, and relax. All right, so now um, let's see. We're going to do our boxing segment. And uh, I want you to know we're going to be putting in some agility into our exercises. I humiliated myself for you. <laughs> I got into a room. I had no idea what I was walking into for the boxing class with bodybuilder men and women. The instructor had won. She was a, a Golden Glove Award ah. champion. And here I am, two feet below and 40 years older than everyone else. Ah. I held my own. I was, I was abysmal in jumping rope, I think because first of all, the rope was for a six foot tall person and my burpees were not enviable. <laughs> but I thought I would die from it. My punch with the bag and glove was, I thought, very good. And even though the instructor kept coming up to me and saying, are you all right? Are you all right? Are you all right? And so anyway, um, I, I think boxing is probably one of the best forms of exercise you can do. And I'm going to show you some moves. We're going to do a little bit of agility moves in our flexibility class. Uh, so, uh, and I may put some in strength and balance too. So we're going to wrap this around. Now I want you to 
uh, hold the band close up to the shoulder. I, I tell you, I never felt so stupid in all my life, but <laughs> it was worth it to get the material. <laughs> all right, so elbows are up. Now, when you punch, it is a boom, like you're hitting something and pulling back. It is not Okay, so here we go. One, two, three, four. And if you stand, you can feel the core engage. Seven, eight, other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, undercut. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Come into the body. Don't stretch out. Come in. All right. Now, hook. Hook right around. Two. It's like a C move. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so now what we're going to do is hook, hook, undercut. Hook, hook, undercut. Hook, hook, undercut. Hook, hook, undercut. Other arm. Ready? Hook, hook, undercut. Hook, hook, undercut. Hook, hook, undercut. Hook, hook. Undercut, hook, hook, undercut. All right, now, punch, punch, lift. 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 Other side. Punch, punch, lift. Punch, punch, lift. Punch, punch, lift. Punch, punch, lift. Punch, punch. Lift. And as you can see, you got your heart rate up. I thought I was going to die from it, frankly, because this woman was a taskmaster like no other. And then we would have to run to the other station and do burpees and then jump rope. I did, you know, I did well on agility. I was surprised. I really was. Because I thought I would hold the whole line up. They have a a ladder that uh, goes on the floor, which I ordered one. Oh no! Because I'm going to do it myself. Because I'm, uh, you go in and out. Oh, oh my God! God. Just that? Huh? Just do it different. Yeah, I mean we can actually just do it in place and, and get the heart rate up. So I'll be going over some of these little gems I picked up in all of my different classes. All right, so now we will do the um, uh, the buttocks exercises. So we have a seat. We turn completely to the side. Band is on the floor. Outside leg, center of the band. Bring the band edges together. And... Take it over and take it back and center. Two. Very good. Good form. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Now knees together, we lift, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And one of the things they mentioned, the new trend in senior exercise, they want us to move a little quicker and become more agile. That is going to do a tremendous amount of good for you in preventing 
falls. A lot of the times we just get used to one gear and it's normally slow. And, you know, no one's asking you to work through injuries or physical challenges that you might have. But a lot of times we can move faster, we just choose not to. So uh, we're going to practice that a little bit, getting you a little quicker on your feet. And, all right, place the outside leg, center of the band. Handles together, over to the chair arm, and take the leg back and center. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Knees together. And lift, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And um, I will be going over in flexibility tomorrow, 9 a.m., Jeff Howard's core and butt exercises for active agers. And I want you to know the room full of us was practically on the floor crawling out on our hands and knees. <laughs> and the instructors got together and they said, active agers in what universe? This, this you know, gee, I'm going to have to dumb this down terribly for my students. And I said, oh my God. And he's going, what are you complaining about? I'm going on to advanced core and butt next. And he's in his late 60s. So um, I'm going to, of course, redo some of those things because I don't want anyone unable to walk the next day. But uh, it was very, very good. Uh, so, uh, you know, picked up just a, a lot of wonderful new things for us to work and to practice on and to integrate. So Can we're going to stand. Can I give you any kind of handouts that you can share with us? Uh, they don't do handouts. Um, what I'm going to do is go online and see if they have an outline for the class. And if they have outlines, I may be able to do that. But it's going to be in, nobody's going to be able to show you uh, what it is. And I can't spend a whole hour just doing button core. So um, it's, it's not, you're just going to have to work with me. Come on into class, do into Zoom, and work with me. Because you know you're not going to pick up those notes later. You know you're not. Or if you do, they're going to stay on the table. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's continue working that core a little bit. Uh, I'm sorry, but. All right, so we're going to take that leg in the back, out to the side, and we're going to kick across in the back. Two, three, and as you feel, it's working that side hip and butt. Four, five, try to stretch it out. Six, seven, eight. All right, pulse. Two, three, four. Engage the core. Six, seven, eight. Side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Back. Lift. Two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. You do ten sets of those, you're gonna feel it. Yeah, really. So, uh, a lot of times, all you need to do with some of these exercises is extend the amount of reps and time. We only have 45 minutes here, so uh, there's only so much you can do, but. If you start extending the time that you do an exercise, that muscle is going to get that much more work on it. All right, so let's take the leg out to the side. We kick 
back and across. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Take it side. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Take it back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Cross. Two, three, four. And you also get the core here. Five, six, seven, eight. And feet apart. Lift on the toes. Hang on. Go to the back of your chair for more stability. Everybody, hang on. Back of chair. Up on toes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And down. That gets calf and thighs. All right, so we're going to just stretch a couple of times. Feet apart. Reach, stretch, and stretch. Spread those fingers apart. Stretch. Lift. Come all the way down. And inhale up. And exhale, feet together, and that's class. Namaste. Hope you have a wonderful day, everyone. Um, I wish we had foam rollers here so I could show you the myofascial release. Um, I, I was almost ready to crawl out of the room on Saturday, and I said, okay, I've, I've reached old age. I, I can't take this anymore. And I said, but I, I want to see what this guy is doing with the myofascial. I got up out of that class. I felt like I was 20 years old. I had no soreness the next day, and it has kept up. It is a beautiful form of releasing muscle tension, but you've got to have a roller, and there's a specific way to use it. So I, I might ask Nicole if, if the the county can order some and we can do some myofascial release. Uh, you have those, the round sponge they're skills. round sponge things. They and they are, I'm going to take them a year to get it here. Well, <laughs> yeah, that's a, another thing. But anyway, um, thank you. Oh, this thing is starting. Where we can buy them, too. Uh, yeah, they have them on Amazon.com, um, and I can, I'm going to look up the number in case any of you want to order one. It changed my life. It really did. I, I thought I was going to have to just give up. Um, seriously. Where did you put it? Oh, it's all over. I'll tell you. All right, 10 o'clock, people. Senior strength and balance. Are you going to show us an example now? Um...